today we're doing a two-in-one review on the Fashion Angels Find Your Wings Unicorn Fantasy Sketch Portfolio Set. This book contains 100 stickers and 20 sketch sheets. And this book is for ages 6 and up. Next to the sketch portfolio set, we have the Statler 32 Brilliant, Brilliant Colors. Yeah. At the back of the portfolio and markers, so we have two example sheets. One is colored and one is not. It shows you what it contains in the book and it shows you what stickers you might get. At the back of the Statler pack, it shows you all the back colors. And at the bottom, we have some color-coded numbers for what colors you can find. Okay, let's get our coloring to shine like a rainbow. Okay, guys, let's have a look at the book. So, here's the first page. Wow, really like it. It's the exact same page on the front cover. But wow. this time, you get to color it in. Mm -hmm. And inside of the horn, it gives you sprinkles and different kind of materials which you can stick on your picture once it's done. Oh, oh the next we have a hamburger cat! Oh, so adorable! Oh, that's really cute! Okay, let's move on to the next the one. The next one. Oh. <laughs> We've got cupcakes here. Yeah. Nice. Okay, that's good, that's good. I really love the way where every picture gets the cone as on their head, mm. the unicorn horn. Looks really awesome that way. Yeah, okay. Oh, that's Have so fun and stay magical. That's so cute, the sweet oh. baby. Oh. Oh, but before we get going, note that my sis loves cats, so if she, if she sees any more, she'll burst out with cuteness. And I love birds, and I hope they add birds inside of this book. Okay, let's continue. Oh, no, whale. Yes, I know awesome. this. This is very famous at the moment. Okay, moving on. We oh, a cactus hugs me. No, what? We're not, no, we're not gonna hug him at all. <laughs> okay, so next we have ooh, nice ice cream sundae. Yum! That is awesome. I love how all of the pictures look. They mm. look so awesome to color in. Yes. All right, let's move it on. Nice. That's nice. really good. That looks sweet. And um, it's basically a hot chocolate mug with whipped cream and, uh, cream and for the chocolate topping, we have the unicorn yeah. horn. Uh, corn horn, get it around again. Ooh, you oh. are magic! Oh, wow! Oh, I never thought a puppy would have um, mm -hmm. a horn and it's got a disco ball. Okay. Sparkle like a gem. Oh, wow. That looks like some kind of troll. Yeah. <laughs> I have no mm. idea who that thing is. Oh, yeah. And then here is our thing. So, wow. That's wow. where we get to unbox the cone and open it all up. And they even show the colored picture. Wow. Oh, these are puffy stickers. They look amazing, guys. Look at all these stickers you get. Wow. Okay, I cannot wait to start using all of these stickers. Well, we're going to use these. Definitely. Okay. Oh, 100% Wow, unicorn. that's awesome. Okay, so we have a whole family. That's pretty good. I like that. Okay. Work hard and chase rainbow. That's good. Yeah. I like all the drawings inside yes. of it. It's very nice. Okay, just give you a two second look. Okay. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> you called her drop care. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I hope she doesn't fall. Wait, mm -hmm. is she on a rainbow? No, is she on a cloud? No, she's nowhere. Mm. Oh, oh that is nice yeah. now. This is a very good picture. Yes. Very good. Okay. Oh, I see some more unicorns. Oh my oh, god. This One, two, three. Yeah, this looks like a wrapping paper picture. Yeah. Or artwork they did. That's very cool. Mm. <gasps> oh, oh, stay me out. You're cool. That's, that's good. So that's a good phrase. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Okay, next. Ooh, another now whale, but with a donut on its head. That's oh, good. Wow. That's good. That's good. I that's like that. That's cool. Okay. Too cute to eat. <laughs> wow. Wow. Um, did was I planning on to? <laughs> no, I don't think nah. so. Okay. <gasps> okay. It's that a is UFO. Amazing. It's dropping food yes. down. Oh, that is. 
it's very, very good. That's now. the best picture yes. I have seen so far. Awesome. Okay. You are something magical. Wow. Well, this is the most detailed page we've yes. seen so far. That's very, very good. Yes, and here's our last one. Yes. This is the exact same one. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Alright guys, so so far we have done the book, but now it's time to look at the Statler markers. Yes, we're going to be doing a review on two things, so that's why we're using the markers to colour in the book, obviously. Yep. Okay. Hiya! Okay, shall I dump it? Okay, all the markers are out. Here's all the markers out from the pack. They're really beautiful and I can't wait to try these out on the new Unicorn Fantasy Sketch Portfolio set. Okay guys, so it looks like we have all the colours in their correct organisation and colours from light to dark. So now all that's left to do is get started to colour in. Okay guys, so let's get colouring in. We found the page that we're doing. We're doing the cactus page. We thought that was very funny and cute at the same time. Mm. So we're going to get started. Let's pick our colours. Alright guys, I'm going to start off with the B and I've picked my colour. Ooh. Yeah. Alright guys, so I got my first con. My con is that it's just, every time I start doing it, the pa the paper is like rubbing in and it's starting to peel off, which is not supposed to happen, so that's my con for the day. It's rough and I just don't like it, and uh, I think it might be good for you guys. I'm a smooth marker person, which means I'd probably use like, like, other ones, markers. Okay guys, so my B is completed. Okay guys, time to do the lettering. Okay guys, so this color is very nice. It's not my favorite, but I do like how it's going. It's a bit more sp smoother, but although I can still feel it coming up. Guys, I'm trying to blend here, but now I'm working here. So guys, I'm just doing the plant part over here and I was using some dark browns and light browns. Uh, they don't really blend well with each other, but that's not the marker's fault because it doesn't even stay on the pack. I was just trying to blend it myself, but it took a while for it to blend in and then finally it did. And I think the result is very, very good comparing it to these markers that don't even blend. I think that's a very good thing. But then what happened was, as I was doing it, I was trying to overlap the colors on each other. I've realized I've just found out that the brown's ink is actually a bit low. So as you can see I have a paper sheet over here and when I am using the marker it's got this type of effect to it which looks like the ink's about to go low like this and I don't know I just thought it should it was um, actually getting low ink. Here's the first line I made. But yeah, it's back to normal again. It just dries up and then goes back to normal again. So that's no problem at all. But if it doesn't dry up like what it's doing right now, it would have been much better. But it's still fine. Okay guys, so now the brown is looking like this. Okay, so I'm going to wait for the brown's ink to come back. But now it's time to color in the cactus. Okay guys, so this is how i done so far. I tried blending, but I really don't recommend blending with these markers. They are not for blending, they're just for colouring in. I actually really enjoy using them. They're very nice, smooth, and very uh, nice to colour in with, but I don't recommend blending because it starts getting dry, rough, and scratchy, and that's not good. I just still do it because I just like doing it. And over here, I went back to my low ink vase pot and I'm starting to think it turned out to be good. I mean, I like the texture it shows here. Wait, am I the only one who's complimenting low ink markers? But anyway guys, back to the cactus. Alright guys, so here's the finished piece of artwork. 
I really love how it turned out. And yes, our picture turned out very great. So here's my review over the this pad, the sketchbook, I think. So I really love it. The quality is just amazing. And just to show you guys, it did not bleed out. I was expecting it to bleed out, but it did not. Yes, that. so that is very good quality paper, and that's a very mm. big, nice y thing. Yep, this book has cute things, and mm -hmm. I really love it. If someone from Fashion Angels could send us another one of your books, and it would just be amazing, and we'll review it for you. I just love how the old the creations are just so cute. Like, who knew that you can have an ice cream sundae, but with eyes on it? Very creative and very cool. So, obviously, you know I'm giving this a 5 out of 5. Yes. This book is very, very cute, and for my opinion, I love this book. I'm definitely giving this 5 out of 5 stars. No cons or anything bad about this book. I definitely recommend it to everybody who loves to color in cute, nice things like all of these pages, and especially if you are a unicorn fan, this book is perfect for you. I love all the detail, and it's just so attractive. It just makes it, it just draws you into coloring more and that's the great thing about this book all right so here's my review over the markers so the pens were pretty good i really liked them but i just don't know about it it just kept on uh like tearing the paper just a tiny dot by dot as you can see guys right over here and over here it just doesn't work out very properly on paper and i think you probably need to buy the artist quality of statler to get it so i just think that this is not for me i like coffee and i really like smooth pens those are my favorite so my review on these markers are going to be, I think, 4 out of 5. It loses a star because of the ink. The ink just ran out as soon as I opened it and it started going a bit scratchy. But luckily, I tried and reused the marker on this again. And yeah, it worked perfectly fine. Uh, the markers are not bad, actually. They're very, very nice. I really love how the smoothness of the markers make you want to color in more. And it's just such an awesome nib they gave you as well. So that is a very good marker kit that this is. I definitely recommend this to everybody who is just starting with markers and is a beginner or who is somebody who has already done beginner markers and just wants to color in for fun. These markers are perfect for them. And that is why I just love to, uh, I would love to color in with these again, just for fun. Uh, although I am a very blending person, I love to use markers which blend all the time and what can shade. Uh, but these are not bad to just to color in with, they're very, very nice. But if you are some kind of expert with markers and you like pro or expert markers, then these aren't for you. You should try other expert markers, but still, these are very, very good. So definitely, this is very, very nice, so I definitely recommend it. Alright guys, but now it's time for the fun part. The stickers! Let's put the palette down on the table. And we're going to choose our stickers. We're going to yes. open it up. Oh, I forgot to mention the stickers they gave are so cute and beautiful. I love every sticker they gave. <laughs> and I feel like not even using it. I want to savor them. But yeah, yes. I love all stickers yes. they gave. Yes. So we're going to open up the pack and start to print stickers down. Okay, all the stickers are out. And they look so cool. Oh my gosh. So they gave this white card so that it looks much better. Because these stickers are on a clear plastic. She, and I think that's very good. So we're going to start mashing stickers all right guys so i've chosen where i'm gonna put the glasses hope they fit oh <gasps> that's so cool now they're best friends actually yeah he's the dad and that's the son all right guys next of all tiny little confetti yep so beautiful all right guys next we're gonna put our last sticker down we're gonna put this right next to hug wow it's turned out to be so much better Unfortunately, guys, this is the end of our video. Please like this video if you really enjoyed this and make sure to subscribe. Then we'll be the, the happiest, happiest kids, kids in the world. world. But for now, we're going to see you in our next videos. Bye! Bye!